What is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video for the brand new viewers. My name is Slowy. We got Todd in the back. He's, he's about to show me his new sled because I actually haven't seen it yet. Bill is going to do a little wind, windshield how-to on Mike's 2022 850 XRS. So that'll be exciting. I'll flip the camera in a minute and show you that. But in the meantime, say hi to Todd. Hello everybody. Hey. Uh, let me flip this camera and look at his sled. Silver, black, and lava red was the color. I like it. Yeah, uh, I figured I would go back to the 600 from the 850. Uh, I didn't care for the 850, a little too much sled for me. And yeah. So, what we're going to do is in the comments, not in the comments below, if we get, let's say, Forty likes. Oh, you're bending down. I'm still videoing. Oh, <laughs> that wasn't even looking. <laughs> so, say we get forty likes on this video. If you want Todd to do a review on his 600 XRS 2022, we get if we get those likes, we'll get Todd out here and we'll do a review one of these days. Yep, I haven't even ridden it yet, so we'll uh, when I get some miles on it and get the feel of it and get it adjusted up, uh, we'll do something else here. Yep. Sorry. No, I was I wasn't even looking. I was looking away, thinking. I'm a little, uh, so now we got this 22 850 XRS. It builds about the. Show you how to change your windshield on it. Just something simple, guys. We're gonna do a how-to on a simple. I'm gonna give a comparison. And what's there and what what we're going to. That's not much of a windshield. It's a, a gauge protector. <laughs> so we're gonna put a X package, 14 inch windshield on there. A little better protection. He did order a bigger one than this. The one that's on my sled. In comparison, it's a little, a little taller. This is a 14 inch. Mine's a 17 inch with a little better protection. He did order one of those, hasn't came in yet, so I'm gonna let him borrow from my 14 inch takeoff. <clears throat> so, fairly simple to do. Kind of firmly grab what's there. And they pop off, there's three little nipples. Grab your new windshield. Line up the old nipples there. And just push it on. That's all there is to it. Got a little bit more protection for him until his bigger, taller one comes in. And it's a simple, uh, simple install of a windshield on an XRS. Or any MXZ for that matter. Windshields all pretty much come off the same. They all pop off like that. The bigger, taller one, there's only two, two screws that need to be screwed on. If you get a bigger one, there's a screw here and a screw there. And that screws down over there. Where's that at? So there's a screw here and a screw there. 
if you get the 17 inch like on my sled. Uh, that's the only other attachment. <coughs> So guys, it's easy as that. Um, I'm not gonna end the video right here. I'm just gonna go stand, I think, outside next to the trail and get a few uh, of the hot shots going by. It's negative six degrees out right now, so I don't know, understand what they're doing. <laughs> very, very cold. <laughs> yeah. I couldn't even imagine a wind chill. So, very cold. Bill, thanks for uh, showing us how to do that. No problem. Simple how-to Yeah. on a 22 XRS, 850. And then if we get those 40 likes, Todd will do a review on his 22. TBD. We'll wait till he gets some seat time. Yes. So we could give an official. We'll get some miles on it. Yep. And we'll get the review. We'll get it out and outside in the bright light and go at it. So that's literally how much traffic is out there right now. And uh, Redfield Snowmobile Club's having their chicken barbecue fundraiser at the Cheese Factory. We'll stop in there for a little camera action, but that was just one group that went by, so that was pretty impressive. So so they're out there messing around, guys. We'll wait for one more group and then we'll wait for one more group and then call it because it's cold. That's it guys, we're gonna resume this video later on. So that's, those are two very big groups, so. It is cold out here. My hand is freezing. This is cinematic mode though. So real quick, we are at the Redfield Cheese Factory. I'm just gonna pan the outside. I'm not gonna turn the camera on in there. And that'll pretty much be it for this video after. We're here for the chicken barbecue for the Redfield Club. Join the club, guys. And then we got the Trailside Hot Dog Roast February 12th. So let's show you what's going on out here. Well, guys, just like that, that video is done. Um, just a quick little recap. We did the um, a little quick windshield how-to. I got some sleds passing by the trail, paying the Redfield Cheese Factory. Great job to the Redfield Snowmobile Club on the chicken barbecue. The chicken was delicious. You guys do a great job. 
Next up is our hot dog roast, February 12th. And I'll put all the information in the description below for that. Um, super cold today, guys. Super cold. The trails are pretty beat. There's a lot of guys out there, but hey, got to do what you got to do. So with that being said, I want to thank you guys so much for all your support. And do me that favor. Play your grandmas, your grandpas, your moms, your dads, your aunts, your uncles, your brothers, your sisters, your friends, your frenemies, your enemies about these videos. Like them, share them. I love you guys. Peace out. And we'll see you next time. Tis the season, baby.